you've been through Why you got scars Since you walked through the door I've been trying to reach you Cause I feel you What's the story to tell? What's the story behind? The mountain you're trying to climb Think I've heard it before Welcome back to another video or if you are brand new here and this is the very first time you ever see my face What's up? I am Jen. I am sharing another week's grocery haul and meal plan video with you guys So if that sounds like your jam, make sure to subscribe before we jump into today's video Alright guys, so we are out running around picking up groceries and getting all the things that we need to keep us trucking along on our health and fitness journey as well as feed our crew So we are grabbing Sam's right now and then I'm super stoked that I am going to check out like a discount wholesale store that is in my area I actually knew about it some years ago and went but completely forgot about it but I just looked it up they are open right now and it's not far from my Sam's so I'm gonna run over there and see what kind of goodies I can find and then I have to swing into Aldi's get some Aldi stuff Walmart Target all the things so if you want to see what we picked up this week just keep watching okay guys first up this week is going to be Target because it's just a super quick tiny little haul just needed a few things from there because I'm hitting up as you already know, a ton of other stores. So I got three packs of the Dr. Pepper Zero Sugar Soda. You guys know if you caught my last grocery haul, I got the two huge packs, the 35 packs of the Sprite Zero Sugar, but my daughter loves this Dr. Pepper one and they had a deal three for 15. So I went ahead and stocked up on that. Picked up four of the Good Culture Cottage Cheese. You guys know I love the Simply Pineapple. I really wish they had some of the old flavors that they used to have, like the raspberry, blueberry, all of that. But pineapple is the only one that my Target carries. They don't really even have the plane that often anymore so just grabbed four of these picked up one jar of this Rayo's pizza sauce it had super good macros and as you know Rayo's has amazing ingredients the macros are 40 calories a serving which is a quarter cup three grams fat three carbs and less than one gram protein i'm going to be meal prepping with this this week which i will be filming for you guys so be looking out for that we already had some rice cakes because we had to pick some up in the middle of the week last week so i only got one pack this week of the lightly salted rice cakes picked up the hubby some of these Nutri-Grain strawberry bars haven't picked these up in a few weeks and he loves these grabbed two bags of the shaved Brussels sprouts anytime I cook Brussels sprouts I always get these from Target it's just easy and convenient to have them already shaved ready to rock and roll easy to cook up picked up a pack of the Applegate Naturals turkey uncured pepperoni I'm gonna be meal prepping with this also picked up hubby some of these Yasso dipped Greek yogurt bars this is the peanut butter chocolate crunch flavor they're 160 calories a piece which I could have but here Here's the macros there. If I'm gonna go in with the Yasso bar, I like just the plain fudge ones and I think they're only like 80 calories. But hubby liked these, so I went ahead and picked these up for him. Picked up another case of the no sugar added fruit cup snacks. Absolutely love these. The peaches, pears, and the mandarin oranges. The kids love the mandarin oranges and I like the peaches and the pears, so it works out perfectly. And then that was it for food. And then you guys know, if you have been following for any amount of time, I like to stock up on like the cleaning or beauty deals whenever they have the gift cards. I'm gonna be picking this stuff up and needing it anyways so I like to just stock up on it when they have those deals so I can stock up on those gift cards so I got some dishwasher tabs some oxyclean because I absolutely love this stuff then some razors deodorant and toilet paper and that is everything from Target for this week Walmart is up next I picked up some of the great value breakfast turkey patties absolutely love these awesome way to get your protein in in the morning got a humongous jar of mild banana peppers I have been absolutely loving them Picked up two more of the Bolt House Farms Classic Ranch. I went ahead and grabbed two just because all the stores around me are out of stock so often. So when they have it, I want to go ahead and just stock up. Got some more of the Minute Jasmine Rice. You guys know I like to get these bigger boxes rather than like the little single serve cup because this has one simple ingredient. That's it. It doesn't have all the other junk that those have. Picked up some Hormel bacon pieces to throw in with my fried green beans. Two cans of the Southwest corn. Absolutely love this on Taco Tuesday or really for anything, but it's a great addition. Super excited for these because nowhere ever has these in stock. This is the Orville Redenbacher mini bags, a smart pop of kettle corn. They are 100 calories a bag. There are the macros there. Super excited to try these babies out. Got the hubby some of the extra calf K-Cups, little guy Lunchables, of course, and then picked up 96% uh, lean ground beef. This is a two and a quarter pound pack. And then I also grabbed a pound of the 93% lean ground turkey for meal prep. So that will do it for Walmart. Now we'll jump into Sam's Club. Okay, so now I have Sam's out. 
Whole Foods and the discount store that I went to. So we'll go ahead and jump into Sam's first because I need to get this stuff in the freezer. So first we got a case of the Chobani Zero Sugar Yogurt. You guys know I like to get this 12 pack and the hubby has been on a yogurt kick again so we've been going through them pretty quick so this works out perfect. Got a huge bag of the Members Mark Boneless Skinless Chicken Breast as well as a bag of their Mesquite Grilled Chicken Fillets. These are already fully cooked so I can throw those in the air fryer and literally in a few minutes dinner is ready to rock and roll. Super awesome to have on hand. There's the macros, 110 calories for a three ounce serving and 21 grams protein. Here I got a huge thing of the Ballpark Beef Franks. This is a 24 count. Everybody in the fam loves hot dogs but we'll also be grilling some out for Father's Day this weekend so I went ahead and just got a big pack. Also, we'll be having some pulled pork, and you guys know this is like our absolute favorite. Better than even I can cook it myself. Like, this stuff is hands down phenomenal. Absolutely delicious. So, picked up one of those. And then picked up, of course, some of the Yukon Gold mashed potatoes. You guys know I absolutely love these. Real butter, real milk, and sea salt. Fully cooked. You just microwave them, and they are ready to rock and roll, and they taste awesome. And they have good macros. 120 calories a serving, which is a half a cup. 6 grams fat, 18 carbs, 1 fiber, and 5 grams protein and we love the ease and convenience of this i don't want to be cooking all day we're going to enjoy each other on father's day and just have an awesome relaxing day so that works out perfect and keeping with that same theme i picked up some of this members mark five cheese bacon macaroni i mean hello does that look phenomenal or what also got some of their barbecue baked bean with beef brisket these are like 100 million out of 10 we had these a week or so ago 210 calories for a half a cup three and a half grams fat 39 carbs three fiber and seven grams protein and they are phenomenal hubby absolutely love those so throwing those on the father's day menu as well we needed some more of the light string cheese these huge packs last forever so absolutely love these okay so i think that i was getting ready to show you guys these i clearly talked too much and my battery was dying i had to swap it out but i picked up a pack of these beef jerky here it's three of the original three tenders bites and three of the teriyaki's these are 100 calories a bag 80 calories a bag and I think these are 80 calories a bag too. 13 grams protein for one of these. Awesome quick little snack just to have on the go, especially summertime. And these will be awesome for the kids as well. And then you guys know I've been like on a major kiwi kick, but they had some of these gold. I don't think I've ever tried the sun gold. I also had one of my sweet followers tell me that they were bombs. So I'm looking forward to trying these out. Sweeter golden kiwi. So I'll keep you guys posted on those. Picked up some more of these pineapple spears. These things are amazing and my daughter is like, obsessed with pineapple if you guys have followed for a while and she loved these 90 calories a serving which is a half a cup zero fat 24 carbs one fiber zero grams protein and they are in light syrup naturally flavored with coconut water my daughter's absolutely obsessed with those i'll also be making as you'll see on the meal plan some chicken kebabs and i'll be using this pineapple also picked up a bag of sweet potatoes because you guys know we go through those like crazy had to get another case of the green beans because you guys know that frying up green beans has been my like go-to side veggie for a hot minute now and then i also got some of these bushes grilling beans bourbon and brown sugar we've definitely missed having beans in our life and so i wanted to go ahead and pick these up they are 160 calories a serving which is a half a cup zero fat 34 carbs five fiber and seven grams protein look at that recipe for caramelized onion sliders i mean yes please we'll definitely have to make those but everybody in the fam loves these it'll be awesome for grilling out and just throughout the summer it's like perfect addition to dinner and it comes with four 22 ounce cans in this pack okay so now for whole foods didn't need a ton of stuff for there i actually ran in just to pick up some of the zevias because you know the pineapple paradise and the strawberry kiwi which are two of their newer flavors i mean they've been out for a while but they're the newest flavors that they've added and they don't sell them on Amazon or in the case that I normally get. I only have been able to find them at Whole Foods. So I swung in there and I grabbed the last ones that they had. And while I was in there, I needed to pick up some more essential oils. I always get mine from Whole Foods. I got some lemon eucalyptus, sweet basil, and sweet orange. Absolutely love these. I use them for a ton of different things. So I needed to stock up on those. Picked up some of the Siete grain-free tortilla chips. These are the dip chip. My daughter absolutely loves these. So I thought this dip chip, because she loves dipping it in like guac and stuff so I thought she would like those so I picked up that bag and then I got some of the lesser evil popcorns these are the little mini bags it comes with eight in here and they're 50 calories a piece Whole Foods is the only place that I can find these around me and as I was grabbing the chips I saw this Taneo is that how you say it I have no idea organic black bean dip which sounded so phenomenal 
and the macros on it are super legit. 30 calories a serving, which is two tablespoons, zero fat, six carbs, one fiber, and two grams protein. And the ingredients on it are super legit. So I am excited to try this. I'll keep you guys posted on what I do with this. And I picked up some of these peanut butter salted filled pretzels. The hubby will like these but I could have some too. They are 130 calories a serving for 10 of them, which is like a nice little snack or addition to lunch. Five grams fat, 17 carbs, one fiber, and four grams protein. So, of course, I'll let you guys know how those are. And then these were right beside them, so I went ahead and grabbed them. I absolutely love pretzels. So does everybody in the family. So, these are the Field Day brand organic low-fat mini rod pretzels. 110 calories a serving, half gram fat, 23 carbs, two fiber, and three grams protein. And serving size is about eight of those, and they're pretty decent size. So I'll let you guys know how those are also. And now for the discount store. I didn't see a ton of stuff that I wanted. They had some really awesome, I'll insert some clips. They had like a huge meat section that had really, really good deals on it. It's more for like almost restaurant style or bulk because they're like a wholesale store. They do break some of the stuff down so you could get some good deals on it, but to like buy meat in bulk or their vegetables in bulk, they had some really killer deals on that. But I'm gonna go back and kind of go through more stuff when I have more time. But they did have some of these swirl breads on sale. And I know my girl Nicole has raved about this strawberry swirl bread and I have never tried it. And this is the thick slice. These are 100 calories a piece, two grams fat, 18 carbs, and three grams protein. And she says these are phenomenal. And these are like almost four bucks in all the stores near me and they were $1.49. So that was a killer deal. And the kids will absolutely tear these up too. They're home for summer. You know, they go through snacks like crazy. I also picked up one of these brown sugar cinnamon cause I know they will love that also. And these are the thick slices. So that was a killer deal for those. They had potatoes for 69 cents a pound. They are super big, nice ones. So I grabbed a few of those. And then I like to meal prep chicken with this salsa verde. And this huge one that is over four pounds was only $5.95. And they're almost for the little tiny jars that are like 16 ounces. They're like almost three bucks. So that was a killer, killer deal. And then I picked this up. I know I'm crazy late to the game. This is the zero sugar starlight Coca-Cola that everybody like raves about. That's like supposed to taste like cotton candy or I don't know. It was absolutely disgusting. Like make me want to throw up zero out of 10 do not recommend I was dying of thirst and it was like a gazillion degrees out so I did drink some of it but definitely would never buy one of these again but it was super cheap and I got it in there so I'm not mad it at least quenched my thirst in the moment but that is everything from these stores now we'll go ahead and jump into all these okay guys so this is the last store that we are hitting up this week we got a massive amount of groceries the family's coming in so that if they're allowed then sorry in advance picked up some avocado oil I needed some avocado oil spray too that's the one thing downside of Aldi's is they don't always carry the same stuff so they didn't have any of the spray so I will still pick up some of the spray from Target but we needed some of this for grilling out so I went ahead and picked that up and then they had some of this crunchy granola protein oats and honey 10 grams protein per serving the macros seem a little bit better than the nature's valley which is what the hubby and I have this is serving size is a half cup which is a little less than the other one 210 calories six fat 33 carbs three fiber and 10 grams protein so i'll keep you guys posted on how that is it was a pretty decent deal picked up some pink lady apples as well as some cosmic crisp apples we like both of them everybody in the house likes them we go through them a lot so i picked up both bags because they were on a really killer deal got a watermelon perfect time of the year to be grilling out summer have watermelon little guy loves this so i went ahead and picked those up i've been flying through blueberries so i picked up two of these got two of the english seedless cucumbers i picked up some of their brand of like the laughing cow cheese this is the creamy garlic and herb which you guys know i love and i was out of this one was only 2.99 they're normally like 3.79 or so at target so that was a decent deal i'll let you guys know how those are picked up some of these apple and cinnamon fruit and grain soft baked bar the hubby likes these i usually get the nutrigrain brand but i think that i have actually picked these up before and they liked them so went ahead and grabbed a box of those got my daughter some crab meat she loves this stuff and then i haven't seen these two good yogurts in there before and these are the meyer lemon greek yogurts i don't think i've ever tried this flavor they were like a dollar 29 a piece but i want to make some of my frozen protein bars with these i think that would be awesome with some other fruit in there so i'll keep you guys posted on those picked up a dozen of the organic cage-free eggs 
Got some bananas. These were only a dollar twenty-nine killer deal. These ones were like three forty-nine for the apples. The grapes were on a killer deal. Also, this whole entire bag was two dollars and ninety cents. Got the kids some cinnamon toast crunch. This was a large size, and they had this one on sale. Also, less than three bucks killer deal. Got the kids also some of these bomb pops, and then I picked up my daughter some of this Ben and Jerry's cookie dough snackable chocolate chip cookie dough. She loves this stuff. Passed right over the strawberries. They didn't actually have many strawberries that looked good, but I hunted and hunted through the boxes until I found this one, and they look really, really good. So picked up one of those, and then I also went to the non-food section. I needed one of these. They had for like eight bucks to attach to the end of the hose for my water and my plants, and while I was over there i picked up little lady the grandbaby this little set she'll love doing this with me and how adorable is that and then this was just an impulse buy that i'm gonna stack up with the american dream nut butter and it was only like four bucks so that was a killer deal and then also got one of these little like magic ink things because little lady likes to draw but this won't make a mess anywhere so that's a win-win so i ended up making another quick target pickup order because i definitely needed some of the avocado oil spray and like i said they were out at all these but this actually ended up being 20 percent off right now the target cartwheel app so i went ahead and snagged two of them this has been out of stock now for like the last week or two so i went ahead and just threw that in the cart so i can have some in the freezer i always like to have these on hand my daughter requested some home style guac with those siete chips so i picked some of that up for her and then just needed some more of the hefty quart size slider bags and the half gallon one and woohoo for the online order this week i am so stoked the nut butter order just came with my favorites from the most recent launch which is squeeze the day almond butter absolutely like out of this world 100 out of 10 if you guys have not tried this highly highly recommend always have a link down below and then the cookie butter crush this actually was like i think my third choice when i did the initial taste testing but it quickly moved up and these are like both tied for one absolutely obsessed with them and then hubby's absolute favorite that used to be called how you brew and now it's caramel crunch cappuccino i ordered him a couple of those for father's day well i mean i would have ordered them anyways but we're gonna give him one for father's day with a cute little thing i'll show you guys i'll post it on instagram so you guys can see it but these are all the nut butters that i picked up for this week now for this week's meal plan monday we are going to be doing baked chicken scampi with spaghetti Spaghetti squash. I've shown how I've made this with both shrimp and chicken. Super quick and easy dinner and it makes for awesome leftovers. Tuesday we will be having the beef flautas with rice and corn. Wednesday will be chicken kebabs on the Blackstone with the mash from Sam's Club. Thursday we will be doing pork chops on the Blackstone with sauteed Brussels sprouts and mashed potatoes. Friday night's dinner will again be on the Blackstone. We're going to be doing breakfast for dinner, eggs, hash browns with onions, and turkey sausage. Saturday will be leftovers and then Sunday is Father's Day and you guys saw we got super easy stuff to cook so that we can just have an awesome spread but not slave away in the kitchen all day long. So super stoked for that. This week's Snacks are going to be cottage cheese, mug cakes, rice cakes and nut butter, of course, and then the frozen protein yogurt pops that I have been loving, which I showed in my last meal prep video, and I also will be showing some other ones in a future meal prep video, so make sure you guys are looking out for that, that you're subscribed, have all your notifications clicked and everything so you don't miss out on any of those videos. This week's meal prep for breakfast, I am going to be doing overnight oats. Lunch, I'll be making turkey pizza bowls, and then I'll be making some more of the frozen yogurt bars. We're going to do chocolate banana, have some new protein powders coming in too, and some other new things that I'm going to be doing with those that I am super stoked for. So that'll do it for this week's grocery haul. We hit up a ton of stores. We got a ton of stuff. Massive haul this week. So we are set and stocked for the week to keep us trucking along on our health journey, feed the kids for summertime, as well as Father's Day. If you guys enjoy these videos, every week make sure to give me a thumbs up that definitely helps me out subscribe before you leave if you aren't already and thank you guys so very much for watching and I'll catch y'all in the next video